captain's one out. It's time for all Essendon supporters to don a sash and make a stand together. Call 1300 Go Bombers or visit membership.essendonfc.com.au today. Well, Crowe, just a few days out from the season opener now, how's Jaden Laverty tracking with his ankle? Jaden's really good. Jaden trained uh, last Friday and again uh, yesterday. And obviously, we've got our main training leads the game tomorrow. So Jaden's made a good recovery. Was just aware of uh, building up his his fitness, given um, given how much he's missed with little niggles over the last month. What about Tom Wallace? Uh, he's been recovering from a hamstring injury. How's he tracking? Tom's going great. Yeah, he hasn't put a foot wrong. Uh, he had a scan to confirm the healing in his uh, hamstring tendon the other day, which was really positive. And uh, look, we'll be considering to build him up through his rehab over the next couple of weeks. James Polkinghorne's one we, we didn't see throughout the, the NAB challenge. Um, how's he progressing with his calf injury? Again, hasn't put a foot wrong. Uh, James will be uh, joining in some training uh, later this week. And um, again, we're just building him up in terms of his match fitness and getting him ready to go. And just finally, Crowey, Jason Ashby, we know about his, uh, his knee injury. How's he tracking at the moment? Jason's um, really good news, to be honest. He, he had his kneecap just slip out and then back in again um, in that game a little while ago. And look, he's uh, walking around really well. Uh, he's, a, he's a chance to run by the end of this week. And from there, we can start to build him up. So given um, what we feared, the severity of the injury might be, we've got some great news with, there with Jason. Crow, it's a pretty clean bill of health at the moment. So hopefully that continues. Um, all the best for the, the first game against Gold Coast, mate. Thanks, guys.